De Morgan's laws give us a way of finding the complements of both the union and the intersection of two sets. So if we start off with sets S and T, then the complement of the union, S union T complement, will be the complement of S intersected with the complement of T. The complement of the intersection will be the union of the complements. That's all there is to De Morgan's laws. If you want to see why it works, stay tuned. So let's take a look at the Venn diagram that's associated with one of De Morgan's laws. We have S and T, and then S union T is going to be the parts inside the circles, all of S and all of T. The complement of S union T then is going to be everything that's not already shaded. That's everything outside of the two circles. To approach it from the other side, De Morgan's laws say that S union T complement is going to be S complement intersected with T complement. So S complement is everything that doesn't include S, everything outside of the S circle. And T complement is everything outside of the T circle. So the intersection is going to be everything that's in both, which is everything not in S and not in T. That means everything outside the S and the T circles. That's the same set that we found when we did it the other way, so these two things must be equal. 